are. Yeah, another day, another car vlog. I think I've said that like four or five times, maybe even in this video. Um, still, not much to report. Just did a uh, shoulder session. If you follow me on Instagram, then you'll uh, you'll already know that. Uh, yeah, big shoulder day today. Getting ready for my competition next month. Trying to sort of make my shoulders look bigger from the front, which we're getting there, slowly but surely. Yeah, apart from that, not much else to report. Starting to get a little bit um, cooler here now. The weather's not amazing. Next stop will be rain. It's autumn here, so I imagine it's probably autumn everywhere, to be fair. Uh, yeah, a little bit windy, a little bit rainy, a little bit nasty. I think the majority of the sunshine is gone now, so uh, there you go. Look forward to the uh, snow. That'll be an adventure in itself, that. But yes, now ready to do something today. I can't even remember what it was. I don't even know what I'm doing. What am I doing? Yeah, don't know. Doing something. Don't know what it is, but yes, that may bring you along. I also, maybe not. Okay, until next time, goodbye. Ah, another day, another car vlog. Two days in a row. I mean, you won't see that, it'll seem like it's the same day, but two days for me in a row. Good going. Absolutely sweating like a pig. For oh, God's sake. Yeah. It was, what do they call it today? I turn this friggin' radio off. Shut the hell up. It was, hello. What is it? What is it? It's like a high intensity day. I've forgotten what it's called. No, or very little weight, like weight training, just a lot of high intensity. And my body doesn't like that. Like half an hour into it, almost throwing up. Oh, well there you go. What the hell? I'm still here. Um, yeah, so not much else to uh, report on. Oh, itchy eyeball. Not much else to report on really. Um, another gym day. It's a little bit rainy today, I don't know if you can see outside, it's a little bit overcast, a little bit moist. Yeah, I haven't really got much plans, not many plans today. Go find some work clothes, I imagine. Find some interview clothes. Um, just go shopping, that's about it really. I feel like I say that a lot. But that is about it really. Um, yeah. I guess I'll see you when something interesting happens. Might not be anytime soon. In fact, it might just be tomorrow after the gym again. Okay, until then. Goodbye. Uh, it's that time again. Okay, it's been like probably a week. Yeah, it's been like probably a week now since, what the hell am I doing? What is this sunshine about, by the way? It's been like a week. Um, so yeah, not much has happened really, that's why I've not recorded anything. Had a bit of a disaster a couple of days ago when uh, we had to return our rental car and my credit card had expired, so I couldn't get a new car. Luckily I've got one sorted out now, so that's fine. I was like, I haven't got a place to do my recording, I'm like, I haven't got a studio. What the hell am I going to do? But I got one sorted out in the end. Um, and that's about the most exciting thing that's happened. So, yeah, again, obviously, as you can see, I'm sweating like I'm, I don't know what. Just finished at the gym again. Back day today. Trying to sort of, I don't really like shape my back, I suppose. It's getting closer and closer. I started, actually, I started my healthy eating um, or meal plan eating a couple of days ago. Um, and that's okay, obviously it's just like 
clean, really clean food. Nothing that you wouldn't suspect to be in a meal plan. So obviously like your chicken and salmon, fish and, and meat, rice, potatoes, veg. But six times a day, which is quite cool. Um, yeah, started that a couple of days ago, so need to uh, need to eat as much food as possible. Um, yeah, it's going good though, I suppose. I don't think there's much to uh, much to report on. Got a new car. It's it's a little bit different to the last one. It's like bright red, so uh, stick out like a sore thumb. Oh yeah, got a, oh I told you I got a haircut, didn't I? Got a haircut. I had a shave. Fudge! Look how much water's falling off me. Look at this. It's gross. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah, that's about it, really. Don't think anything else has happened. It's been quite miserable these last couple of days, but it's nice today. So we might do something today. Might go for a walk. I've not shown anybody the houses. Not shown you the houses that I like yet, have I? So uh, I may swing by the uh, swing by the lake and show you the lake houses that we're gonna get one day. Like future, future houses. Maybe, probably not. But you never know. Um, yeah. Anyway, I'll see you in a little bit. Okay. So yeah, another another car vlog. Um, it's not uh, post-workout today, which is nice and strange. A little bit different we're out and about today. Um, yeah, just out and about doing a few bits. Um, so I'm about two weeks into my diet plan for uh, my show that I'm doing next month. Uh, to sort of give you the long and short of it or whatever they say it is it's as I suppose you'd expect a pre-show diet to be whenever you think of the generic not generic that's the wrong word whenever you think of the very sort of general thing that, that a gym goer a, a proper gym girl would eat you think of your sweet potato and your chicken oh god it's a new day yeah I don't really know I don't really know what happened there to be honest I was talking about um, the diet that I'm on at the moment um, and how it would be shut the hell up right every single time that's on um, how similar it would be to something that you could probably almost make up yourself everyone knows roughly what healthy eating is it's not hard it's just being disciplined to put it in a diet so like I was saying my diet consists of as you would imagine the chicken sweet potatoes really any meat to be honest um, carbs is limited so the only carbs I have are on a high carb day so a high, high carb day would be a compound day, so a chest day, leg day, back day. I'd have a high carb day, so, and my carbs would be oats in the morning. Um, on my next meal, which would be my post workout meal after my shake, I'd probably have a sweet potato with a source of protein, so meat. Another meal would be maybe some more potato with, again, more meat. It's quite boring, quite straightforward, but. That sort of stuff works for sure it definitely definitely works um, that's roughly what my diet is I know it's not much it's not very exciting but that's that's literally what it is a few veg here and there not much so asparagus every now and again maybe with one of my six meals a day or t no I think veg is with two meals a day um, so I have six meals a day. Every single meal is definitely with protein. And I'll have a uh, two scoops of protein after I work out straight away. So now I'm in the car, I've just finished working out, I've got my protein. Um, and at the very least, I'll have a, uh, one scoop of protein with my almond milk before bed. So that's at least three scoops of protein a day. If I can't fit in a meal, I'll have another 
I'll substitute an, an entire meal for a protein shake so that every single meal I have is high in protein. That's the idea is obviously to build muscle and repair as, as, as efficiently as I can. Um, so I suppose, yeah, no, I just wanted to get give an insight into my program as well. I will, at some stage, if I can, I'll try and share a little bit of information with people. Um, so as I mentioned, I have high carb days and low carb days, and those days are dependent on what exercises I do. So today I did arms, which would usually be a low carb day, um, but I've already started my high carb day, so I'm gonna finish off. Arms on its own, any accessory exercises, to be honest, it's, it's gonna be a low carb day. Tomorrow is gonna be a low carb day. It's more heavy lifting and big compound exercises that are gonna need to be high carb. Um, I mean, I've not, I'm not the most intelligent person in the world. I've not, I've not researched why, but, at, you know, I'll figure it out at some stage. Um, anyway, um, so I, I gym six days a week. Of those, they're probably split 50-50 between big heavy days and kind of, there's at least one day of HIT in there that we're doing at the moment. So HIT training um, incorporated with like a chest workout, so boxing and, and, and chest workouts together. Lots of supersets and drop sets and those sorts of things to really get your heart racing. Um, but yeah, no, as soon as I can, I'll, uh, I'll start showing you some of the exercises that I actually do. Um, and if you want to follow that routine, then I suppose as soon as I can, as soon as I can organize something to share with everyone, then I will. I'm not sure on what sort of format that would be or how I would do it. Um, but it's, I've been doing it for probably three weeks. I've been eating properly for about a week and a half, two weeks, like strict eating for about two weeks. Um, working out for about three weeks and I've already seen improvements for sure. I've not weighed myself so I don't know how much I've gained or lost or uh, hopefully gained to be honest but visually there's definitely there's definitely an improvement which is obviously good um, but yeah I suppose it's just now about keeping my muscles full after working out so that's why I gotta go home drink my protein shake go home and eat some food straight away and uh, start prepping my meals for the rest of the day. But yes, I suppose that's about it for now. Uh, nothing exciting is happening. The weather is completely shite at the moment. And I don't think it's going to get nice again. I'm going to show you this. Hold on a sec. Look at the state of it. Absolutely gross. There's Timmy Hortons here, but wherever. Here, by the way. I was going to pop in there, but as I said, I'm being good, I'm not allowed to be naughty, but no, look how shit it is outside, it's gross, it's going to be like this now, probably in, until summertime next year. So yeah, um, again, any suggestions or anything that you want to see, let me know, I guess until next time, goodbye.